For several years, this area is best located when referred to as Haurangadegi in Kano Metropolis. Jamila Abdullahi owns this joint where one can find all kind of gadegi tea at any time of the day. Its price ranges from 50 to 100 naira depending on the ingredient and test. Gadegi as people used to call it is not something harmful or dangerous as some may want to believe and it has no difference from other normal tea. It's combined Lipton, ginger and some other ingredient. Gadegi tea is a mixture of sugar and Lipton of Highland brand, usually boiled in water with some plants such as African mahogany, lemongrass and mint plant. We used to mix sugar, Lipton, ginger, lemongrass, mint grass and several other herbal ingredients to make it even more tasty, depending on what the people want but it has no drugs whatsoever. Those who consume Gadegi believe that it can increase their power of endurance and their ability to work for hours without fatigue. We do take Gadegi any time we are going to work because it gives us extra energy. In fact, if I don't take it, I used to feel lazy. Although it gives the users the needed satisfaction, Gadegi tea is neither certified nor regulated as food by NAFTA. Generally, as per tea, we, we NAFTA register tea and of course we regulate tea, but tea has packaged tea, not tea popularly sold uh, uh, with, uh, with herbal preparations. If it is a packaged tea, branded, Package tea branded like Lipton, like Dala tea, like Highland tea, and many and many of such tea, we regulate them. But the concoction, some people just that popularly call Meshai, that they will just put in herbs and boil it and give it to people to take. We don't regulate that. Although most of the plants used in preparing Gadegi tea have medicinal uses, but expert believes that their combined effect in Gadegi may lead to some serious health issues, especially among those who have been taking Gadegi herbal tea with some drugs to improve its effectiveness. Idris Jubrin, Trust TV News, Kano.